morning to all. Today, 31st January, we keep the feast of Don Bosco. I am sure you must have heard a lot about Don Bosco. There is a film called Journey, which portrays the childhood days of Don Bosco. That movie got the best children's movie award in 1993. In that film, we see little Johnny going around with a beautiful smiling face, attracting many children to his company. He is very active, very enthusiastic and going around with a smiling face. It doesn't mean that there was no difficulties in his life. In fact, there were a lot of hardships and problems. His dear dad passed away when little Johnny was two years old. Then Johnny had a elder stepbrother with whom there was fight almost every day. A poverty-stricken family and little Johnny had to do a hard manual labor at the young age itself. But in spite of all this, we see Johnny is going around very happily, attracting many people. This joyful nature, John Bosco had all through his life. And all through his life, he had problems. He had to fight with civil authorities, ecclesiastical authorities and so on. But he was a highly optimistic person. This optimism and joy helped him to attract many youngsters to him. Actually, many youngsters flocked to him. And he loved them. He organized different programs for them. And he helped them to find out a work so that they could live very decently in the society. And that helped him to form themselves. And it was the dream of Don, Don Bosco to make them good citizens and uh, upright persons. And he used to tell them, it is enough that you are an young person for me to love you. At another occasion he said, I will spend to my last breath taking care of you. And this care and love John Bosco had to his youngsters is continued today by his followers, Salesians all over the world. In Don Bosco Manuti too, the reason for our existence is each one of you. And today, on his feast day, we assure you that we love you and you are the prime reason for all our activities here. And together, we shall form ourselves to be good citizens and upright persons and for which Don Bosco lived his life. And wish you all a happy feast of Don Bosco. Thank you.
to teach and help for poor children. He, he once said, do not put off till tomorrow. The good you can do today may not have way tomorrow. Thank you.